Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to start up Windows 7 into safe mode. So this should be a fairly quick tutorial and we're going to jump right into it. And the basic key here is even if you're unable to boot into normal Windows operating system as you can see here, you can still perform the tutorial as we're going to be walking through today. So basically whether you're able to boot into Windows or not doesn't really matter too much. So we're going to restart our computer and if you're just turning on your computer for the first time you want to be tapping the F8 key repeatedly as your computer is restarting. So just tap the F8 key as your computer is restarting. Okay, so now underneath the advanced boot options, we're about 90% of the way there. You want to use your arrow keys on your keyboard to go down to the three safe mode options here. First safe mode, it's classic safe mode, pretty basic core drivers and services. Safe mode networking, basically you have internet access in addition to everything listed above. And the last one will be safe mode with the command line window. So a few different options here. And let's just say we want to go classic safe mode here. So I'm just going to use my arrow keys to select safe mode. And then I'm going to hit enter on my keyboard. And this should take a second, so you just want to be patient here. And there you go guys, we have booted into safe mode. And next time you restart your computer, it should not boot into safe mode, it should boot into a normal Windows operating environment if you did and followed this tutorial as I show it. So, pretty straightforward tutorial guys, and I do hope I was able to help you out. And as always, thank you for watching, and I will catch you in the next tutorial. Goodbye.